What up, guys? Uh, I have some news. Des Moines, Iowa is going to be canceled tonight. Uh, I know that we put out a post yesterday saying that the tour would resume um, today and that we are going to have to cancel Madison, which was the day after, but that's not going to happen. I haven't sang since Pittsburgh, which was on Thursday. And we've been just, you know, taking time off, letting, getting some vocal rest. And, uh, you know, when we announced that yesterday afternoon, we just assumed that the four days off would heal me up enough. But, uh, yeah, I went and sang last night. And pretty much nothing's coming out of my throat, particularly for my heavy vocals. Uh, I can sing a little bit, like, you know, the clean stuff, the kind of falsetto-y stuff, the soft stuff seems to be kind of there, but when it comes to the heavy vocals, nothing. It's kind of scary. Um, the Des Moines show... And Madison tomorrow are definitely off. The St. Minneapolis, Chicago shows are possibly off. Um, you know, I'm going to do everything I can today. Yeah, I went to a, I, I'm going to a throat specialist today. They're going to take the camera, stick it up my nose and look down my vocal cords and see what's going on. The uh, I went to a clinic in Cleveland the day after Pittsburgh. And, uh, you know, I'm not sure what, you know, it was a pretty basic facility. I mean, but, uh, yeah, this sucks. This really fucking sucks. And, um, you know, I haven't gone to a uh, official throat doctor or even an entertainment doctor who takes care of this kind of stuff. Uh, mainly because the dude just said what I have, you know, he was like, here, here's some cough medicine, here's some antibiotics, but they're not going to work. What you have is, you know, this thing that's savaging the U.S. right now. And, uh, and it's not going to be fixed by antibiotics. So... You can take them, but it's going to be kind of pointless. I've had it for a week and a half now. I started getting it in Toronto. And uh, the next show in Buffalo, I literally felt like I was swallowing, gargling fire. Uh, woke up the next day in Pittsburgh, and my lungs literally just felt like I was inhaling fire all day. Couldn't stop coughing. Um, <laughs> I still can't stop coughing. And it's not broken up. It's like deep in there. And it's been a fucking week and a half now. So, uh, you know, I was just hoping that taking four days off would kick me back into gear. You know, heal up my throat enough to power through the next batch of shows, as it usually does. And, uh, it just didn't, and this thing's still with me, like, I don't feel any fucking different. I'm sick as fuck, coughing like crazy, stuffed up, it's kicking my ass. As my friend Kim calls it, she calls it Tor AIDS, <laughs> which is a very appropriate term, fucking like Tor AIDS, you know, um, but I got an appointment to go to a throat specialist here and and uh, and hopefully they can see what's going on you know if anybody who's followed the band knows that this is not usual you know if, as long as my throat's working I'll play through fucking anything you know 
Montezuma's Revenge, fucking stick a bucket over on the side of the stage and I'll fucking go diarrhea in between songs. You know, fucking gallbladder, fucking hernia surgery, like, I'll fucking throw me on some pain pills, I'll fucking power through it. You know, fucking blowing out my eardrum in Kuala Lumpur, fucking reroute the shows, I'll be there. You know, as long as I can sing. But I can't stop coughing, and my fucking throat is just blown out, and uh, there's no sound coming out of my voice. Actually, there is a sound. It's, I don't want to say there's no sound. There's a sound. It's not an appealing sound. It's, it sounds like fucking a sea lion. Arr, arr, arr. What the fuck is going on? I couldn't get through three songs yesterday. And, uh, this sucks, man. It really fucking sucks. It sucks on ten different levels. You know, it sucks for the fans. It sucks for the people that have been waiting to see it. It sucks for the agents. It sucks for the promoters. It sucks for the managers. It sucks for the band. Um... You know, there's a lot of cogs that make this machine go, and, you know, we're losing a shit ton of money by blowing out those four shows, and now maybe even more. Um, you know, and if we lose Minneapolis and Chicago, it's a fucking, you know, the whole tour may be in jeopardy at this point. From just, we might not be able to survive the financial loss. We'll do what we can. But we're already losing a lot of fucking money. You know, the tour is a loss at this point. And uh, we're going to try and do everything we can to power through this and finish up the dates. And we'll keep you posted. But, uh... You know, I appreciate all the people that are out there defending me. A lot of fucking assholes talking shit. Now I, uh, believe me, there's nobody beating up, <laughs> nobody's beating up me harder than me. You know, I feel like shit. I'm fucking embarrassed. I hate this feeling. You know, it's the weakest feeling in the world. And, you know, I'm not going to sit here and say I'm the most manly dude, but I hold myself to a fucking impossibly high standard. I want to go out there and fucking crush it every night for fucking everybody there and when I can't it sucks man it genuinely fucking sucks and uh you know I'm sinking into a depression here just cause I can't do what I'm supposed to do and uh You know, I'm going to get through this, but we're going to have to take it day by day. I'm not exactly sure when the next day of the tour is, and at some point we're going to have to make a decision whether the whole tour has to go. Uh, I'm going to do my best to make it happen. I'm going to go see some top-notch doctors right now, like world-class dudes and hopefully they can get it. I've been talking with Melissa Cross. She's gonna send me some fucking thing to blow in or something. I don't know. <laughs> it sounds like some, some crazy witch doctor shit, but, but I'll fucking try anything at this point. Um, no, sorry, ma'am. For everybody who bought tickets, for everybody who hasn't seen us, for everybody who's been waiting. Um, you know, this is, this is, this is hard. Yeah, I feel fucking cursed with my health. You know, fucking 
blowing out my throat and fucking ears and Montezuma's Revenge and fucking Jesus Christ, man. <sighs> anyway, I'm not supposed to be talking. <laughs> I've been talking now for 15 minutes. And, uh, thanks for your patience. Thanks for... Thanks for the love. I've been getting the well wishes, man. You know, I've been ignoring the haters. Every, you know, it's like I can get fucking 50 well wishes and then one dude sends me something negative and I'm like, like, ain't that the fucking way it is? But I've been seeing the well wishes. I appreciate it. Thank you. Love you too. Take it easy. Keep you updated somehow, maybe via general journals or whatever, I don't know.